Just to think, it all started my boy Naquan being the streets hustling at the Red Eye as his lieutenant. Now I'm the boss called the shot. Meet K Blood, our new recruit. See him on the block one day and ask if he wanted to elevate his payroll and put him on game. Meet Draco, aka the blacksmith. He can provide you with anything that can blow a nigga's scout back. And for that reason, you won't see him in public. Meet Kid, the shot caller. Also my right hand man. Now that you met the crew, let's go for a little drive. Let me tell you a little something. Still alive. All I know is somebody that stepped up and beat the boss, so I was the one that took over. This is the life of city. I ain't gonna lie, being this boss has its own perk. I got my own private collection of cars, private helicopter, private jet, and every now and then the homies go to the club and blow money just for the hell of it. But it's crazy how all of this fame and glory can be taken away by one simple mistake. As time went by, our business was going so smooth. We had people all over the streets of Los Santos asking to work for us, but you get put on SOTB. What's SOTB? Guess we'll have to find out. My right hand man, Kid, even had an inside at the docks. I'm talking anything new shipment came in, we was on it. Alcohol, electronics, guns, explosives, just random narcotics. I mean, anything you can think of, we had it before it even came to the dock. Eventually, word got out. How much of the best we had in the street? So we was able to save up some paper, get our own little warehouse. And that's what business just got started. For about a good three or four years, everything was going good. I got my money up, got my cars, houses, private jet, and all that. And as you know, being a boss has its own price. Things got rough, and I had to disappear. The fans was on me so bad, I had to pack my bags and get out of town. Either I was going to be in life in prison or six feet under.